tournament that began as the most turbulent and tumultuous first two rounds ever as the two teams everyone wanted in the title game and Duke has it first. It's Bosco down inside playing against Brand by himself. Let's see what happens the first time Brand touches it. Avery again. Left open. What happened there, Jim? Connecticut's in a 2-3 matchup, and they never were able to get adjusted on that long rebound. Trajan Langan on Elamine. Elamine does have quickness advantage on him, and here is Hamilton. His first shot is dropped for two. Avery's got about two inches on him. They bounce it off of the pack of Bosco. Carrollwell with a heads-up play. Battier left open for a three. Oh, this young man missed 19 straight threes in 1998. Here's the old matchup, Moore and Avery. Moore gets past him, and he'll take nice. it for two. The senior teaches the sophomore. Floor, El Amin gets it ahead to Hamilton. What an effort. He'll challenge Langdon. And nice. Ricks turns around and rips the nets for two. But how about that recovery on the floor? Keeping the ball alive so it wasn't a turnover. They're going to be in the second half to the preferred end. Now Ricky Moore steps in. Second time he's taken it inside, both times he's delivered. So far the press, although hasn't turned it over, again he's wide open, hesitated. And the freshman still though, knocks it down. Corey Maggetti. And take it, take it. Hamilton, they don't have to ask him. Oh, that was a foul. He follows it up though, off the glass for two more. And there was Battier fouled on the block out, but nobody blocked out the shooter. How many? They're going to isolate more on a guy like Battier. Get it back. Moore with a good fake. Take the jump roll. And he's scoring tonight. Six points for Ricky Moore. As a freshman and sophomore. Duke's getting what they want when they beat that press. Look at Maggetti go. So quick. And it falls. For a moment, it looked like it might spin out. Well, Jim, as I said, again, loose ball to the Huskies. More three-pointer. He's got the feeling, folks, in the championship game. 15 from the field. Allen Iverson said he's the only man in college basketball quick enough to guard me. That's saying something. Look at our main dish to Saunders. Right inside. It's the first run anyone's put on Duke in the tournament. 15 to four run, and Trajan Langdon over Mooring. But gets a breather. UConn can match him with depth. Oh, without question. Oh. Carrollwell, good move. And Duke's back ahead. Point. And Jim, he's the guy that stopped Arthur Lee. Four for 13, a team please. Two for 15. There's Avery in one of his patented threes. And Scooty Penn, three for 13, but by Elamin. Avery gets oh, the roll. A break. Well, Augusta Jordan. Rand again with those powerful hands. They better not try to. He Look at this, he lost control and won. Oh! oh! With a little hook. You don't see that often without a foul. Which again, that leaves Elton Grant on El Amin. We'd like to take him one on one. El Amin at last. El Amin. Didn't expect to see too much of that matchup tonight, well, did we? And Hamilton with six points. Give him eight. Hamilton, too tall. Shot right over the top of a Bosco. Stuffs him, and the Huskies are looking to regain the lead. To the middle, Freeman in the lane, it puts it up, UConn back ahead. Taking it right to Duke. Johns, Connecticut in the Garden, the Big East Tournament. Blue St. Johns out of there. Brand on the offensive glass for the putback, his first field goal. It took him 12 and a half minutes. Ricky Moore quickly. Fades away, and Ricky Moore continues to sizzle. That's in the offensive end. But McGetty wants to penetrate on every move, doesn't he? Look at that move to quickly square up in midair. I think he... Bosco ought to find himself somebody a guard. Good Look at Moore ball. go to the hole. Lost the hand. Oh, this is incredible. More and more. It's looking like UConn can stay with the Blue Devils till the very end. So therefore, you shouldn't go ahead and try to draw those charges inside. He's just not going to call it. Brand on the good feed from Avery. Nice one in the nation, more weeks than was Duke. So it's not like this team has to make any excuses why they're here. Moring puts it up with the left hand. And Connecticut. Hey, Jim Calhoun getting these seniors, Jones and Moore, playing solid basketball. Right How about there, it? right there, Rushbell Jones, they, as you call it. They've been there before. 
Hamilton would like a screen. Drives in, floats, and it falls for two more. You see, they're not calling that charge at all. But if referees are consistent, you've got to make that judgment as a player. Langdon bangs, bangs it home, a second three on the night. Trajan, much an Elton Brand out. Bosco able to play this first half with one foul. Final 25 seconds, though. Langdon, and one! A three and a one, right? Or did he get a two? Was he he's, put on the line? He's given it a three. Moore saves it to Bosco. You feel like El Amin could break out in this half. And he hits the opening jumper to tie it at 39. That's the second. Two fouls. Second one came with nine minutes to go in the half, and then he's set. Here's Langdon, and Langdon is warming up. The extra. They allowed Duke to make five out of ten threes in that first half. That's the second foul on Carowell. Hamilton to Bosco, and he puts it up and in. Good job by Hamilton to recognize that somebody was going to pick him up in the baseline. We have our ninth tie of the championship game. Langdon, he is so hot right now. Again, Jim switched over on Trajan Langdon now. They've seen enough of his outside shooting. Graham for the easiest two of the night for the player of the year. Into Freeman. Freeman for two. Fresh for rebound. Carowell to Battier, the assist to Chris Carowell. What happened? Brand and the Duke baskets coming much easier than they did in the first half. Mooring guns it in for two. Yeah, one thing you can say about Mooring. Here's a three. Just when you call for it, Freeman battles for the rebound. Two strong for Battier. How about that? He did. There's a double team on one. Why? Why? How about that? Delivers. You know Hamilton. And he wants to run and shoot. There it is, and the lead. Great job by Hamilton, pushing the ball down the floor. And keeping Brand off the blocks down low. Langdon drives in to tie it back. Trajan Langdon, the fifth year senior. The 90s and the championship teams to now, back to the elite status. And Hamilton is now back to his scoring ways. He's got 16, including five in the last minute. Bosco. Got it back. And there is Khalid Al Amin. And meanwhile, in stores. Double double team this time. Brandon. Brand in and back to the line for one more. Jim, that was the first time. Well, and here comes a fresher Connecticut, Jim. And look at Hamilton. Couldn't be set up any better. Jim, Mike Krzyzewski needs a timeout here. His team has hit the wall in terms of stamina. Nine minutes remaining. Open as Hamilton, you can't do that. Jim, great screening inside. Moore set the first screen. Come in, but it's rejected. They throw it out of there, Brand rejects it. Avery to Brand wow, on the drive. Oh, yeah. Boy, is he running. Holy mackerel, you talk about a big guy being in shape there. But Duke can't get down the court quick enough to get off their three. Carroll up quickly with a two. Well, you gotta love him. Jason, Trajan, Langdon everywhere. He can't fight through any screen. Carowell wants it. Carowell ties it. Came up so big offensively in the second half against Michigan State. Has to be aware of where Hamilton is right now. Aware here too. Five on the shot clock. Yeah, I mean, gives him the lead back. He loves the leaner. Critical. Three and a half remaining. Hamilton left open after Bram went for the steal. And a three gets him the five point lead. He rips the long one. Carowell three pointer. Lock out by Freeman. And Great rebound. Battier gets it out. Langdon three. The senior Langdon. delivers. Sensational play by Battier. What a rebound. Go. Eight on the shot clock. El Amin with Brand defending. Splits the defender. And it's a three point game. How much guts is that to take the ball against Brand inside? Recruiting trips together to Virginia and Kentucky. They decided on those trips they were going to go to the same school and they chose two. And now they're down one with 54 seconds to go. Hit the key free throws. Two shots coming for El Amin. You'll need a three to tie. 
Trajan Langdon's going to take it the length of the floor and try to get it off. He doesn't have a lot of time here. Pressure from Jones. Langdon trips, and UConn has done it. El Amin comes over and says, we shot the world. Folks, you got to believe, because just when people say you can't, you can. And UConn has won the national championship in its first attempt in a final.